From Soldiers Radio and Television, this is the Army Today, a daily feature from around the globe. Get their hands Ready? on it. Okay, here we go. And cut. The U.S. Army Reserve officially opens its first fully functional solar-powered training facility in Illinois. The new Joliet U.S. Army Reserve Training Center will be home to 600 quartermaster and transportation personnel. The $36 million, 60,000 square feet complex was built as a modernization effort and as part of the Army Green Initiative. Well, the Army in general, the federal government, is on this green initiative where we're trying to make, uh, ultimately, our facilities net zero. The key to this initiative is the use of photovoltaic arrays, or solar panels. The facility is a pioneer of their use in the Army Reserve. Solar array is designed to produce 150,000 watts hours of electricity per year. That is approximately 80 to 90 percent of the electric load of the facility itself. Not only is this a big step for the Army, but it's a big step for the Army Reserve in partnering with the communities on a higher level than what we're accustomed to. Instead of just implanting ourselves in there, we're really becoming an integral part of the community. And as one local official expresses, the military and civilian partnership makes for a better relationship and mutual respect all around. Not only is it an economic, uh, a dynamic part of our economics in the village of Elwood, uh, but we also feel it is our duty and our responsibility as citizens of the United States to support our armed forces and our troops. Uh, and I think that this is an extension of that and we look forward to having them here. From the new Joliet U.S. Army Reserve and Training Center, I'm Army Staff Sergeant Doug Anderson. That's the Army Today from Soldiers Radio and Television.